For the most part, the reason behind owning a tomahawk is that you're always ready for action. It doesn't really matter that you have the right tool if you cannot use it the moment of need. This is a good way to dispel illusions. The EXT-01 is a tough, agile tomahawk finally crafted in the USA to exacting standards by Hogan Incorporated and designed by former Marine Recon and custom knife maker Alan Aleshowitz. The hand-honed bellied edge is excellent for chopping and slashing, while the pointed heel and toe are capable of penetrating cuts. The back of the head can be used as an impact tool, and two holes accept optional pry bar, hammer, and spike accessories. Eliminating top heaviness, the skeletonized head makes it lightweight and very fast in hand. The blade is made from S7 tool steel, chosen for its shock-resistant properties. Durability is further improved with a cryogenic heat treatment and a kiln-baked Cerakote firearms finish. The handle has a partial tang set in a tough G10 using Hoke's custom heat-treated hardware. The thick slabs of G10 offer resistance to chemical and moisture damage, as well as impact resistance. When the hawk is placed in the G10 sheath, powerful magnets hold it while the catch is manually engaged. Although very secure, the tomahawk can be quickly and easily drawn. The mechanism is fastened to a contoured polymer waist paddle that clips onto your belt. Optionally, the paddle can be swapped out using the TechLock compatible mounting bolts on the back of the G10 sheath component. At 14.125 inches in overall length and only weighing 0.95 pounds, the EXT-01 is one of the toughest pound-for-pound -pound tomahawks available, making it well-suited for tactical and sporting roles alike. Today at CRKT, we're going over the specs of one of the coolest tactical axes we've ever seen. You could say compact tomahawk. Ryan Johnson of RMJ Tactical designed this piece, and he told us this one was inspired by ancient Viking weaponry. And there is no doubt. This is the Rune. The overall length from the base of the handle to the top of the head is exactly 12 inches. And to the end of the utility spike, to the axe edge measures in at 6.7 inches. The overall weight is 1 pound 8 ounces and this thing is built to last. That's 816 grams and it's designed to be used in tactical situations. No SWAT team or special forces group kits are complete without this welcome addition. The tool is forged from SK5 carbon steel with a black powder coated finish for extreme corrosion resistance. This notch on the blade is specially designed for choking up on for exceptional control and you can see both ends of this tool are sharp and versatile. The handles provide excellent grip in all conditions with or without gloves and the handles and sheath are both made of tough glass reinforced nylon, extremely durable. The sheath has a lot of carry options. You can strap it anywhere and clip the buckle, it's secure and mission ready. Join our social media community. Use the hashtag confidence in hand. And as always, thanks for watching and thank you for choosing to carry CRKT Knives and Tools.
Gerber Downrange Tomahawk. Comes with a low profile molly sheath that can fit on just about anything. Easy release snaps let you get at the Tomahawk in no time. The Downrange Tomahawk has three primary breaching functions. The first is a pry bar. This pry bar has a cant in the head to allow maximum leverage. Up top on the ax head, you have an integrated prying handle. This gives you real estate so you have positive control when you're executing the pry. On the reverse side, you have a hammer head. This has maximum surface area and is welded in place. On the opposing side, you remove a button here and can quickly and easily eject that Kydex sheath from the tomahawk. This exposes a large blade with a point on the bottom. This is great for hacking through ropes, twine, anything else in a hurry. It also has two G10 handles along both sides. This gives the user maximum control and confidence during swings or during prize. The downrange tomahawk is 420 high carbon steel. It's been heat treated so it won't bend under stress. Proudly made in Portland, Oregon, this is the downrange tomahawk. Lamb from Viking Tactics and I'd like to show you a little memento that I brought back from overseas. This is a little axe that I carried on a lot of the missions I did in Iraq and uh, what I had done here is I'd found this on one of the objectives. I knocked the wooden handles off, I polished a few of them up, I gave them to some of my guys on my team and uh, this one I kept for myself and I carried it wherever I went over there. The reason I carried it I thought it'd be a really handy tool. It had a pry bar, a hammer, a blade, a place that you could pull nails here, whatever you might need. And if I lost it, it wasn't going to bother me much. So I showed this little axe to 511, and when they saw it, they decided it'd be really cool to do an operator axe. So that's what we've done here. So we got a super sharp blade here with a long beard. You can uh, look at some of the old tomahawks. They also have a very long beard like that on their axes. We also have the hammer point. We have a pry bar built in at this end. We also have different size tools built in. We got a half inch, three eighths, an inch and a millimeter wrench built into this as well. There's also a quarter inch socket here. And then at the end, we have the ability to actually rip sheet metal if you need to do that. If you're trying to cut into a vehicle, not that this would be the only tool you use, but this is a, another tool that can be used for that. Once again, this is the 511 Viking Tactics Operator Axe, and I really think you're gonna like it.